So if you couldn't tell from the previous videos that I posted on this channel, I am a, uh, I'm a, I'm a low baller. They're basically low balls for a living here on Skyblock. And one day when I reached a 3 billion coin purse, I thought to myself, yeah, that's enough of low balling. I actually need to grind the game for once, because if you looked at my net worth to levels ratio at that time, it, uh, it made me seem like an aerial trader. So that is why I decided to buy myself a mage set and a Hyperion, and actually start grinding the game for once by doing some Diana, leveling up, and even getting Enderman Slayer 7, which made me unlock the Terminator. And of course, I made a bunch of videos on that, one where I had a Soul Eater one, one where I had a Duplex and Fatal Tempo one, but never have I ever been a proud owner of all of those three Terminators at once. And then one stream when I decided to do some lowballing, this happened. Uh, um, it's a Terminator, Fatal Tempo 1, Power 7. Oh my god. No, oh my god. Oh my god, I got another Terminator. And just because of that, I now have three Terminators in my inventory. And of course this video isn't original whatsoever due to Future77 doing like a bajillion of them. But you know what, I don't really care, Just you can just call me Future66 at this point. But it's fine, cause he also got his permission to do this video, so we're okay. But before we get into today's video, I am currently in a sub war with Mr. Sleepy Boy. We're seeing who can hit 5k subscribers the fastest. So if you want to help me win this race, please make sure to subscribe and like. Because if I do win it, I'm going to do a 100 million coin giveaway on the Discord server. So make sure to join that as well, but with that said, enjoy the video. Okay, so if you're watching this video, it is most likely that you have watched Future 77's video about the three Terminators as well. But my story of how I obtained these three Terminators are actually very different from his, and of course it involves flipping. So at first I lowballed this 9 star Solito 5 Terminator, and then after a week I just realized that Duplex 1 books actually dropped a lot in price, because if we just take a look at the bizarre... Yeah, they used to be like 16 million coins, so I decided to craft that one myself, and then I just lowballed this Fatal Tempo one, as you just saw in the intro. And of course, to test these Terminators, I'm just gonna do three different things. The first thing is that we're gonna do some dungeons, and unlike the other videos, I'm gonna attempt a solo floor 7 this time, to see if I've improved or not, or if I'm still skill issued. And then we're just gonna do some dragons, and hopefully just end this video off with some Kudra gaming, if everything goes to plan. But first off, I will need to have a floor 7 setup. And I'll get that by just simply... There we go. Now, I did eventually try and solo a floor 7, and I actually beat Maxor. But when it came to Storm, I struggled a lot. And by a lot, I mean to the point where I got very frustrated. I swear to god, I'm just gonna quit the game, you know? Let me do that real fast. But he, like, he won't get crushed for some reason, watch. Okay, so he's, he's up there, right? He's shooting his uh, stupid fireballs, whatever. I go to some pad. Can't do anything, because he's actually following me. And then look, three seconds after, he just goes back to the middle. Like, this has been going on for maybe, like, 10 minutes or, like, 15 minutes straight. Like, I can't do this anymore. This is just absolutely painful. And yeah, yeah, look, he just... This goes up and freaking fireballs him, like, trying to lure him, so he just, like, uses his uh, freaking mechanics and goes up there, but he goes to the middle for some reason, every single time. And then I died, and yeah, that was basically the summary of my floor 7 run. And then I just entered the floor 6, completed that, and then just quit life for that day. Oh my god! And I know for a fact that there's gonna be one person that is going to be like, Oh, but uh, but I can solo floor 7, but I'm only a shadow assassin. Like, like, no, you cannot. It's just physically impossible. Unless there's just a huge skill gap between us, which it probably is, but uh, still, you, you, you just can't if you have shadow assassin armor. Anyways, I decided to include the floor 6 clip into this video because, well, you know, ferocity ticks equals satisfying. Okay, so yeah, after that very scuffed floor 7 run, I'm just, I just gave up because I just probably wasted like half an hour on that. And then just the dying, which wasn't ideal whatsoever. So I'm just going to boost my ego and do a solo floor 6 run. Hopefully I don't throw. Okay, so just a few more mobs. There we go. Now the watch is dead, I guess. And we'll just claim these blessing and then I'll just 
crank up the volume so you guys can hear the ferocity takes it will be so satisfying Okay, so we got everything set up, just placed on the overflux. We got the fatal tempo and then the duplex one. Actually, no, we're, we'll take the we'll take the soul leader one first. I'm just gonna use fatal tempo and then soul leader. That was so satisfying. Let's try duplex now. I'm just gonna do the golems. There we go. And then just finish off the giants real quick. Dead. Yep, and they just die. And now time for Sedan. Okay, just hear the ferocity takes. Alright, anyways, we just got a solo floor 6. Let's go. Now that we have tested all three Terminators in dungeons, let's test them against dragons. Alright, so now we're just gonna do some dragons. And yeah, we're just gonna use the set of terror armor and then this fatal tempo terminator and the duplex one. I'm just waiting for Not Hyperion to come down. Anyways, I'm gonna place four eyes. He's gonna place four eyes. Actually, let me crank up the volume first. Get a protected dragon. Oh my god. That is an absurd amount of damage, you know what? And we get a protector chest plate, let's go. Then just spam our fatal temple terminator. Get another protector. Oh my god. <laughs> you hear that ferocity tick? Oh my actual god. Okay, we did not get first place, which is sad. Bro, that ferocity was crazy though. What? And after those dragons, I actually did try and do some Kudra. If you just take a quick look at my scuffed hotbar. But it didn't go so well because I'm just absolutely skill issued and we just died before actually building the ballista which is quite embarrassing if I'm actually playing hot tier with two hype mages. So yeah, me doing a Kudra and actually testing the terminators in there is gonna be a no for me sir because I'm I'm just generally too skill issued to do that. Now to answer the important question, is it actually worth it to buy three terminators, each of them costing around 700 million coins or more? just for a small increase of damage and I would say probably not like if you just unlocked Eman 7 and decided to buy Terminator then Soul Eater is probably your best bet because the Soul Eater bow works good in master mode then no just normal catacombs you can still do a lot of damage to dragons if you have Dragon Hunter and it's the cheapest out of all of the options and I've heard that you can do tier 3 Kudra with a Soul Eater 5 Terminator so Soul Eater is just 100% on top and in second place, I think we have the duplex bow because duplex is just, it's so fun. Like if you're going to do dragons, then duplex is probably your best bet. And it's good for boss fights as well. And then on third place, because of the price, I'd say fatal tempo because fatal tempo, it is, although it is satisfying with all of the ferocity ticks, it's just not worth the price that you're actually paying for this bow. But yeah, in short summary, if you just want to buy a Terminator, then buy a Soul Eater one. And if you're extremely rich or do poor financial decisions like I do, then buy either Duplex, Fatal Tempo, or just both of them. But yeah, that is probably going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy it, please make sure to subscribe so we can beat Slippy Boy in subscribers. But with that said, have a great rest of your day, and I'll see you in the next video.